ever considered a snug piercing? Let's get into it. The snug piercing, also known as the anti-helix piercing, goes through the inner cartilage near the top of the antitragus. This is one of the more painful cartilage piercings, and not everyone's anatomy is a fit. This is a very difficult piercing to heal, so it's not recommended for people new to piercings. This piercing requires precision due to the thickness of the cartilage, so do your research and go to a reputable piercer. What should you expect? The piercer will choose the spot along the ridge to pierce based on your anatomy. A curved barbell is typically used and the piercer will decide on the gauge and length of the jewelry. This is a tough piercing to heal, so choose a high quality material like implant grade titanium. Healing's a journey and it can take six to 12 months or even longer. Expect lots of swelling and you'll need to downsize as swelling decreases. Follow your piercer's aftercare instructions. Generally use saline spray twice a day, don't touch the piercing, avoid snagging it, and avoid bodies of water like the beach or the pool. Don't use headphones, hats, or anything else that can touch your ear. And don't sleep on the piercing, use a neck pillow instead. Once healed, style it up. Curved barbells are the typical jewelry used and you can mix and match the ends. Check out bodyartforms.com for unique barbells and ends. Straight barbells and rings might also work depending on your anatomy. Ask your piercer what type of jewelry your anatomy allows. And that's your quick guide on snug piercings. Hope it helps.